We start with that local breaking news alert. A man is dead after he was shot on A. Philip Randolph Boulevard tonight. The Jacksonville Sheriff's Office says he was in his 30s or 40s. As of now, no suspect has been named in this investigation. And with that, News for Jackson reporter Bree Isom joins us live from JSO headquarters. Bree, what have you learned about this case? Yeah, so they actually just cleared that scene on A. Philip Randolph Boulevard, so we decided to go over here to JSO. But basically, JSO was telling us that the man was found outside of a vehicle. Tow trucks came earlier to remove that vehicle, but that's where the man was found. Here's some video that we shot from earlier tonight, so you can see what that scene looked like. Officers were dispatched to the intersection of Pippin and A. Philip Randolph Boulevard around 6 this evening. Police say the man was found with a gunshot wound and then transported to a local hospital where he then died. Early indications show the suspect was was fleeing in a dark color vehicle to the west. That's according to JSO. Neighbors say they heard gunshots last night in the same area, so they're worried. It was quite scary. I mean, because bullets can come from anywhere. Anything can happen out here. It's really scary. Yeah, a lot of neighbors told me they heard about 100 gunshots last night. I asked officers if this was related, and they said that they didn't know yet. They are still investigating. They're also still trying to find a suspect in this murder. I'm reporting live from JSO headquarters, Bree Isom, Channel 4, the local station.